getting ready to pack your bags for a trip to Spain? Well, you're in for a treat. The country is packed with exciting adventures and cultural attractions to fill up your travel itinerary. But before you get on the plane, there are a few things you should know. Let's take a look at 10 norms, customs, and facts that'll make your journey a whole lot easier. Number 1. Light breakfast, big lunch, and a late dinner Eating habits may be a bit different than what you're used to. In Spain, you're not going to find a breakfast of champions option, because the first meal of the day is often quick and light. Most people stick to coffee, toasted bread, an egg, or a pastry. But at lunchtime, Spaniards turn up the heat with a big meal in between 1 and 3.30 p.m. It's often the biggest meal of the day. You'll want to eat a big lunch, because dinner won't be until around 9 or 10 p.m. The last meal of the day is often accompanied by a steady flow of wine and late-night conversations. Number 2. Excellent Public Transportation The ease of public transportation in Spain is a lifesaver for travelers. Renting a car can be expensive, and navigating unfamiliar roads can be intimidating. But fear not. The metro, buses, trains, and taxis make up one big, fine-tuned transportation machine. No matter where you need to go, an affordable transportation option will be just a stone's throw away. If you're taking one of the high-speed trains, book your tickets online in advance for the best prices. From the big city airports, you'll have the option of taking the metro, or aerobus, in Barcelona directly into town for just a few euros. Number 3. Tapas Culture If you haven't heard of tapas, get excited! Tapas are small plates of food kind of like an appetizer, that are served with alcoholic beverages. Traditionally, these snacks were complimentary, but since the increase of tourism in Spain, tapas are, unfortunately, not always complimentary these days. However, if you go to a less touristy part of town, chances are the little snacks will be on the house. There is a range of tapas options. Sometimes you get to choose, and sometimes you don't. You can expect things like slices of ham and cheese, a Spanish omelette, potatoes, and more. When you get back home, you'll wonder why tapas aren't a thing everywhere. Number 4. 49 UNESCO Sites As of today, Spain is home to 49 UNESCO World Heritage Sites. Big number, right? That puts Spain in fourth place for the most UNESCO sites in a country. Italy is placed at number 1 with 58 sites. The country's World Heritage Sites are scattered across the country. They were recognized by UNESCO for their cultural significance or influence on a global scale. Some of the most famous UNESCO sites in Spain are the historic center of Cordoba, the city of Toledo, and Alhambra, a palace and fortress in Granada. It might be hard to see all 49 sites, but you should try to see at least a few of them. Number 5. Pickpocketing in Cities Spain is a safe country to travel in. But like any popular tourist destination, petty crimes will happen. Tourists in Spain are often targets for pickpocketing. As you leave your hotel, stroll through the city and sit down for a bite to eat. You might realize your wallet was snatched right out of your pocket. Ah! Don't let the threat of pickpocketing deter you from visiting, though. Just take a few easy precautions to keep your belongings safe. Don't keep things in your back pockets, and be cautious in crowded areas, such as metros. Walk with your backpack in front of you, and leave valuables in your accommodation when you can. Follow those tips, and you'll be good to go. Before moving on, if you are getting any value from this video, please like and subscribe. It really helps the channel grow. Okay, let's continue. Number 6. Diverse Regions and Cultures People might not realize that Spain is an incredibly diverse country in terms of culture and geography. From long stretching plains, to stunning coastlines, to jarring mountains, to rivers and wetlands, you'll find all kinds of ecosystems within Spain's borders. The very geography makes it exciting to visit different regions and see completely different environments. Just like the geography, the people and cultures are equally diverse. Spain has been ruled by a number of different groups, and their influence can still be seen today. 
Within Spain, there are five different languages, exciting traditions like flamenco dancing, and several well-preserved historic buildings that date back thousands of years. Number 7. The Moorish Influence Another interesting fact that many people don't know about is that Spain was once ruled by the Moors, which was an Islamic group. The Moors controlled Spain between the 8th and 15th centuries, and had a significant impact on the country. Many of the mosques were rebuilt into churches and cathedrals, but travelers can still see the distinct thumbprint left by the group. So, while you travel through Spain, make a point to appreciate the architecture like the Alhambra and delicious cuisine that the Moors introduced. Number 8. Jamón Can't Be Missed A trip to Spain isn't complete without eating jamón. It's a cured piece of pork leg or shoulder that's considered some of the best in the world. The meat comes from the black Iberico pigs and is typically cured for two to four years. Yes, that long, but the wait is worth it. When the meat is finally ready to go, the results are flavorful pieces of ham that are to die for. You can find jamón in specialized shops, butchers, and local grocery stores. Number 9. Tipping is a little different. In places like the United States, you're considered the scum of the earth for not tipping. While in Spain, the custom is a bit different. Tipping occurs in the country, but it's not expected in the same way it is in other places. For the most part, it's up to you. Many restaurants will include a service charge in the bill, which covers any need for a tip. But if you're at a fancy restaurant, or if the service was amazing, leave a tip. It will be greatly appreciated. The standard tipping percentage, unlike elsewhere, is just about 10%. Number 10. Spaniards Love Fiestas Spain knows how to have a good time. If you're looking for a party, well, it won't be that hard to find. Big cities like Barcelona, Madrid, and Valencia have a booming nightlife. You'll have an endless number of bars and clubs to choose from that match your partying style. Before a big night out, start the party off right with a cold pitcher of sangria to get warmed up. With the rich and diverse culture, the fantastic food, and great natural beauty, Spain is definitely worth a visit. What is your favorite thing about Spain? Leave a comment down below. That's all for today's video. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already.